Hello, this is HK Training Center. In this time, let's learn about how to modify machining order. Lead in direction which are mostly changed by cam workers. If machining has been made with automatic machining, or change order after manual machining. Let's find out how to modify by order machining. To change machining order, click Modify in Machining after Make Machining. In there, click small arrow on order machining to show many methods of changing machining order. As shown in picture, machining order can be changed using first to fourth. First, second is used to change order inside a part. Third, fourth is used to change order outside a part. First one and third one can change order by each click. And second one and fourth one can change order by using window, which can change in batches. Normally using third one can change order between parts by each click or change order partially. Select after in order mode and change order by each click. If selected before in order mode, selected part will be cut last, inverse. In case of change, order inside a part can be done by order sequence by each click. It can change shapes that inside a part, same angle, or all identical parts. I'll show you in the program. First one, order cut sequence. And third one, order the parts cutting are used to change order if inside part are nested irregular in large part. In second one, order cut sequence by window. And fourth one, order the parts cutting by window. Think orthogonality tolerances as range of applying sheet for order cut sequence. And select wanted direction in each order mode from red dot. If you want to change order in zigzag, input larger value in orthogonality tolerance. I will show it in program. Second and fourth are used to easily change order in batches. When parts are with fixed pattern, easy to divide by area or four inside holes. Next, let's try to change lead in position. I think this is most carefully modified by CAD CAM workers. 
head collision can be evaded just modifying lead in position. In Lentech, lead in position can be checked after machining. Lead in position can be modified by using semi auto and lead in outs. It is recommended to change lead in position, which can evade head collision by avoiding head pass through parts are already cut. Lastly, let's learn about how to change cutting direction. This function is used to change Kunter's cutting direction CW or CCW, which are normally used to change starting point with lead-in in the edge of part. Some workers try to change lead-in position to the edge, but for edge lead-in, cutting direction must be changed to change starting point. I will show it in program. Until now, you've learned about modify machining. Next time, you'll learn about shot marking which is one of cutting techniques. Thank you.